टुडे विल सी ए क्वेश्चन ऑन एथमेटिक सम टू बी सॉल्व यूजिंग एल्जेब्रिक इक्वेशन तो द क्वेश्चन इज शोन इट सेज हाउ मेनी पेयर्स ऑफ नेचुरल नंबर्स आर देयर सच दैट द डिफरेंस ऑफ द स्क्वायर्स इज 63 आंसर इज ऑप्शन ए 3 सो वी सी द सॉल्यूशन बट बिफोर दैट वी विल जस्ट रिब्रश आवर नॉलेज एंड लर्न व्हाट आर नेचुरल नंबर्स दीज आर द नंबर्स व्हिच आर एग्जिस्टिंग ऑन नेचुरल लाइन नेचुरल नंबर लाइन so 1 2 3 etc till infinity these are positive numbers and these are whole numbers whole number means 3 by 4 5 by 3 etc these are not natural numbers so now we'll see the solution now as per question let's assume that two numbers are x and y so question says difference of the squares is equal to 63 So x square minus y square equal to 63. This is the equation we have formed. Now a very basic algebraic knowledge. X x square minus y square is equal to x plus y and x minus y. So we'll split this into this form. X plus y and x minus y is equal to 63. So hope we are clear up to this point. Now we'll factorize 63. So 63 can be factorized as 9 into 7, 21 into 3, and 1 into 63. Now, when you are taking LCM etc. etc. to factorize 63, generally we don't count one. So be care- very careful. Otherwise, uh, if you miss out on this, your actually answer will go wrong. So we have found three factors for 63. Now we'll see the solution problem. Now for first factor 9 into 7, so we'll put up higher value of factor that is 9 as x plus 1, x plus y. So x plus y is equal to 9, and x minus y is equal to 7. So when we solve this, you'll get x is equal to 8 and y is equal to 1. So we'll just see how to solve this. This is again very basic knowledge. X plus y is equal to nine, and x minus y is equal to seven. This is what we are saying. So when we add this, so this becomes sixteen. Y and y will be cancelled out, and x and x when they are added, they becomes two x. And when you solve it further, x is equal to eight. So in this manner, we obtain x is equal to eight. Now put up the value of x. in any of the equation you will get y is equal to 1 so this is how we have obtained values of x and y for the first pair now for the second pair the values are 21 and 3 so x plus y is equal to 21 and x minus y is equal to 3 so we'll get x as 12 and y as 9 so you can see all these numbers are natural numbers now third one is x plus y is equal to 63 third one is sorry third factor is 63 into 1 so x plus y is equal to 63 and x minus y will be equal to 1 so when we solve this we get x is equal to 32 and y is equal to 31 so these are also natural numbers so with this we can say that there are three such pairs possible and that is our answer option a is the answer so thank you very much and thanks for watching